Hello everybody, welcome to game number 11 of the Cheeky Girls up against Nurgle. Which, you know, is ostensibly a really, really easy game. But they do have a lot of strength, which is annoying for Amazons, because Amazons are only strength 3. Like a strength 3 bash team is not really very good against, uh, you know, loads of strength 4. Of course, he, you know, Nurgle are terrible, don't get me wrong. But, you know, the strength can be a pain in the ass to deal with. And obviously the tentacles stop them dodging away and stuff. And he's got a block beast. Strength of Warriors. So yeah, you know, they, they do struggle with a lot of strength sometimes. Um, but he's 1, 2, 3 with Nurgle, and he's got Nurgle, so, you know, this shouldn't be too difficult, but still, it's um, it's certainly... It's not as easy as you would think. Like, you know what I mean? Obviously, still mega, mega favoured. Les dés de blocage sont parés au lancement. Direction le terrain pour ouvrir les hostilités. I'm not trying to downplay my chances in any way, but certainly a lot of strength is, you know, can be tricky. Bonjour à tous! Ici Jim Johnson et Bob Bifard. C'est pas toujours facile de s'attaquer à un joueur aussi dégueulasse! En effet! Alors quand c'est toute l'équipe adverse qui est concernée... Hello, Fluffy Burrito. Not really. Um, it's Amazon's. <laughs> so there you go. <laughs> Playing Amazon's, they they barely qualify as Blood Bowl. Yeah, I've got to win Chalice with them, have I? No, I'm not, I'm not going to win Chalice with them. I'm not going to come close to winning Chalice with them. Um, no, I don't know. I think New Amazons will. Because New Amazons will... I think New Amazons will definitely have more chance of winning Chalice. Somebody asked about any more thoughts about New Amazons earlier, sorry. And hello, Runbad. And hello, anybody else I haven't said hello to. Um, somebody said about New Zones. New Zones have definitely got more chance of winning Chalice because you get two super, you get two super players, right? You get two gods of Blood Bowl and backed up by line women. So you basically get um, Eliod's vampire team. Oh wow, that's a wonderful start. You basically just go, okay, not that wonderful. You basically just get Eliod's, uh, Eliod's vampire team. Um, I think their two blockers are not just the best strength fours in the game. I think they're probably the best players in the game. Better than war dancers. No, that's not true. But they're very good. Like, they're very good. They're not, obviously not better than war dancers. Nothing's better than war dancers. But they're very good. Interesting. Yeah. 
The funny thing is, the only data, the only real data we have for Blood Bowl 2020 involves picking. Sold yet? Not bad, thanks. Ah, he's done GFIs to get away from the thing over there. Yeah, the only stats we have are from the competitive division of black box, haven't we? That's the only stats of any of any relevance, and they're only like half relevant because half of it is pick, half of it is picking. So Zons have got a 67% win rate or something because they haven't had to play Dwarfs most of the time. And also there's there's a huge amount of Black Orcs. So a lot of the, it, the stats are how easily you beat Black Orcs as well, right? So it's it's a bit weird. It's a bit... It's a very slight... Those Black Orc numbers are going to come down once people... And the nobility are going to come down once people are used... Like, you know, don't have an obsession with playing the new teams anymore. So, so it's a it's a skewed like population and a hugely skewed uh, win rate with picking. So it's it's a weird one. Enough stats, I mean, aren't relevant at all except enough. I mean, I would definitely rather play Lizards. <laughs> I wouldn't want to play Black Oaks at all. But like, they're just because they're new, isn't it? People play them because they were new. Not because... No, well, some people might have played them because they thought they were good. But nobody should be playing them because they think they're good. Oh, shut up. Shut up! Well, this, this can happen against anybody, can't it? That is some absolute bullshit. Absolute bullshit. 1D, full power, dead. I mean, brilliant play by him. Absolutely fantastic play by him. Holy fuck! My only weakness rolling any dice at all in a dice based game. God. 
Yeah, so I thought I'd give him the rotter, then at least, at least, uh, at least Kimberly Walsh can live on as a rotter. I mean, people mostly should use the spider spots. Because, you know, most people are worse than me. <laughs> Without being big headed. It's just true, isn't it? Most people are worse at Blood Bowl than I am. So, therefore, they should try and win by uh, trying to high roll. And, like, it's the same thing, isn't it? It's the same thing, like, you know. If you're playing poker against somebody you're better than, you should, uh, should be more aggressive, try and get lucky. Maybe call with Jack High if you think your opponent's got Ace High. <laughs> you could still have Madonna on the team. She's 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 the one who's been in probably 80s, 90s, 90s, 10s, 20s. <laughs> Fucking how many decades has she been now? Just 80s, isn't it? 80s, 90s, 90s, 10s, 20s. Five decades of Madonna. Probably. I don't know if she's done 20s or not. Definitely four or five decades. Four or five decades for Mariah Carey, too, isn't it? Oh, God. Oh, the comedy mega is strong, isn't it? Three cas in three turns versus somebody who's won three, six or something. He's just terrible. And he's got the terrible team. He's terrible at Blood Bowl with a terrible team. And he's just going to beat us with dice. That is Blood Bowl. A kebab en route. I'm going to give Shell Mighty Blow. Shell's already got Mighty Blow. And a surprise tackle as well. <laughs> that would be very disappointing, wouldn't it? If you, <laughs> if you got Cheryl home and found out she had tackle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Flipperio, there are people like that. It's funny, there's a guy who, uh, there's a guy who we used to play poker with, who uh, he was actually, uh, he actually like, you know, turned pro at uh, Dust Till Dawn. Um, because, and he was terrible, like he was, he was the easiest person to beat. Because, um, you know, he just had zero creativity whatsoever. So, like, but like, he was, he obviously he beat all the chumps. You know, just pure ABC poker. So he beat all the people who were bad um, very easily. But obviously everyone who was good. I would much rather just beat him. I'd rather, I'd rather play him than somebody, you know, new to, new to poker. Because he just got, he, you know, he's got nothing for a good player. Oh god, I followed by mistake. Um, purple tentacle, never mind purple chest. Misclick the follow, hopefully it doesn't cost me. I regen? What? Fucking dice lord. How you've got a screen? Whee hey. <laughs> One, two, three, four, GFI, GFI. Let's run a little bit back there. Yeah, that looked like the, I, I thought there was no regen, but it was. Rough. He's made two regens. Like obviously the the drive isn't going that badly now, but next half's gonna be rough for three three cast. And he's coming back. The calls. Beautiful calls. 
I don't know any of the cores, though, and I didn't like the core songs, that's the thing. I like, I actually like S Club 7 songs, and I like Girls Aloud songs. <laughs> and I like Cheeky Girls songs. <laughs> and I like Kylie songs. Randomly throw all in in cash games is, uh, oh yeah, non-cash games, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'd take the pitch out of pitch, pitch out of non-cash games. Or do you mean like just play money? I don't really know. I wish didn't like the witch songs either. Now, when you mean non-cash, do you mean like not actual money, or do you mean like tournament? Yeah, I mean, there's plenty of time, isn't there? There's four, five more turns, so I thought run back is a good idea. Abba. No, no, it's 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 Cheeky Girls era, and and see, it's Cheeky Girls era, right? So it's Cheeky Girls, S Club 7, Steps. Girls Aloud are a bit cheeky, but there's four blitzers and there's four girls and girls allowed, isn't there? Because, as we all know, Nicola Roberts does not exist. <laughs> 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 uh, my jumper is purple. She is a figment of uh, blue. <laughs> She is a figment of every everybody's it's imagination. Blue. My jumper is blue. I don't know why I said purple. <laughs> <laughs> what do I do here, though? Oh yeah, Mylene, oh yeah, yeah, all right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, strong choice, Mylene. Can I need the pound, I don't know. Well, maybe I don't have to, maybe I can just block. Fuck me. Wahey! Wahey! Glorious guys! Damned real life! Yeah. Maybe it wasn't that good! <laughs> like anybody could do anything, couldn't they? Like anybody, like Chris Moneymaker, shit, and he won it. Imagine being called Moneymaker and being a chess, a chess a poker player. That's pretty funny, isn't it? Hopefully he'll just activate the beast without a friend now. Try and punch that. Portaloo. It's nearly plim plum blue, isn't it? I like that the beast had two and I just dodged them both away.
ballon est en sécurité. À l'autre équipe de prouver le contraire. Oh, c'est tout sauf une bonne idée de finir sa course si près de la ligne de touche. C'est un coup à se faire pousser. La dernière fois que c'est arrivé, il a fallu trois jours pour reconstituer le corps. Yeah. Right, if I power this one, then this one will get through. And if I push him, then what can this one do? So I think it's probably better to hit him. Off him. And he can base the ball. I guess I'm not edge four, so it's not that bad. Maybe that's okay. Il vient au secours de ce joueur. Ça va faire mal. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay. Not bad. Tu sais quoi, Jim Je sais chanter Oh non, par pitié Vraiment oh oh Pas la peine d'être méprisant Mon coach personnel dit que j'ai une... Hello, no. de ah. Waterloo. But they kind of do like Waterloo, Ancy, don't they? Because the, if you go there, apparently I've never been. But I've heard that it's like... If you didn't know the result, you would have thought it was like... Commemorating a great French victory is like there's a big, you know, all just like worshipping how great Napoleon was at Waterloo. <laughs> so there you go. You know what Dimmy's biggest takeaway was? <laughs> Shish <-cuffter. laughs> uh, Just a joke. Hilarious. Why did the Dutch build a big hill? Because they've, they've never seen one, so they want they wanted to have one. Or is that just is that just Amsterdam that's uh, really flat? Or is it just all of them? I've got no idea. Oh baby. No regen. Regen, he's we've both made three cars, but he's made all his regens and I failed my apple. Sad.
Nice. Encore un joueur à terre. Le coach va finir par sortir de ses gonds. I'm definitely not going to farm past the squirrel. Not a nil nil. No, no farming at nil nil. This is. This is happy gym's. Happy gym team. This is not a. Uh, this is not. Make a chalice winning team because it's Amazon. It's just literally. Mental health first, which means not losing. It does mean, however, four cars in the first half. Um, so it might be losing. No, not beating up Nurgle. Made three cars, but they all regen. He's made four cars and the apples failed. So I've been, it's been an absolute comedy mega dicing. Absolute comedy mega dicing. Unbelievable. Complete fucking joke. Might just score here actually, because got no players left to stall with. But like obviously giving him two KO rolls and that, that doesn't matter. Giving him an LOS, but <laughs> Dodge double G if I do absolutely. It's a one turn, isn't it? I'm not even giving him a two turn because it's his drive. It's just giving him the LOS. I don't want to give him the LOS hits. But then, my other option is to go there, blitz, and then I've got dodges to. But then I'd, I'd have to. I might not even protect the ball with them. Yeah, it's just another LOS, isn't it? And already only got eight players. I mean, do have the edge four, so that's good. But the, the problem with Nurgle is, if they're ahead, they're like they're the best. They're, are they the best team if they're ahead? Probably. Because they've got like the tentacles that stops you getting back in the game, aren't they? So like they can kind of shut you down more than any other team when they're ahead. And boy, are they ahead right now! Uh, but I mean, still, it's not a loss anyway, is it? At least it's not a loss. Well, it could be, I guess. If he makes three cars here, <laughs> if he makes three cars here, it could be a loss. Still got time to go badly, badly wrong. Craig David. Nine one one. Yeah. Do you reckon? Nine one one were a, were a boy band in the nineties. I should do a miss sometimes. Glorious. No, I won't give in. 
until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Glorious beard G89. Welcome to Team Fantastic. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's been a while since we did Among Us, isn't it? It was since uh, since Skuro and uh, <laughs> Gadenic killed it. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. Yeah, sorry. the The adverts are pretty oppressive. They've they uh, they offered me six minutes an hour this time, so. That is quite a lot, isn't it? But I'm not going to say no. Yes, exactly, Skuro. It's just, it's just, just a joke. I'm not even going to try GFIs to get a punch. On. Right, eight players. We could try a Daka, but then could just score quickly. Depends how he sets up, I guess. Ace of base. Yeah, I guess they were they were they were a little bit before cheeky girls. I think. I think they're probably too far before. Plus, like, how do you how like how do you get rid of any of these? You know. Like, you can't go to the Cheeky Girls, because it is the Cheeky Girls. You can't get rid of the fucking Girls Aloud. Can't, can't drop Kylie. Could drop a... Uh, I guess Hannah Spirit could be dropped. And, uh... Lisa Scott Lee could be dropped if she didn't have plus edge. <laughs> But like, can't drop any of girls like that. Too good. There's no quick tutty here, is there? Mm, but there is an LOS. There is an LOS banging to be had. Nah, I mean they're ugly. PJ Harvey is sickeningly ugly killer. The fact that they're, uh, yep, yeah, fuck off. The fact that, you know, these are all, these are all hot as well, aren't they? That's the thing. They've got to be, they've got to both be, have good songs and be hard. Oh, he just didn't perfect defense. Brilliant. It was already perfect. You can't improve on perfection. Well played. Hacker tracks. Good decision. I don't know why you're booing. I thought you had made a great decision. Carry on! Why would you carry on that? Going for the old half dacker here. Can't give up my LOS hits. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> it's important that we differentiate my superior <laughs> oh, oh, I've got no idea. Chicken, broccoli and rice, Flux Streamer. Isn't that the only the only dinner? Chicken, broccoli and rice. But yeah, it's funny, in regard, regards to Chalice, I think New Zones will have a much better chance of winning at high TV because they'll have... Um, because they'll have... two superstars, won't they? Strength 5, Edge 5, Move 8, whatever. Strength 6, Edge 4. Two players like that. Imagine if you had a team with that four players, yeah, it'd be something else, wouldn't it? on the blockers. Block, then stats. And then just have an insane... two insane players. I wouldn't even take card. Because you might just roll a shit one, right? You can just roll, you can get block, and then you can take move, and you can take move, and then if you roll move or AV or move, that or uh, move or passing, then you just go, oh, well, now I'll take card or whatever. Or tackle. The problem with the guard is, like, do vampires take guard? No. They take, they get blodge step and tackle, don't they? Like, you're not really needing a guard on them because they are your players that just go and do everything. So they don't, like... You know, if it was, like, a redraft or something or, like, you know, maybe some kind of format where there was limited time, then maybe you would go guard on them, but... I think just stats is, uh... No, they're general in strength. They're general in strength. Oh, on line women. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, line, men are, line women are just general. So line women would just go guard and then save up for doubles or go AV. Yeah, but you still just wouldn't take guard on a vamp anyway, would you? Like, it's just not good. Like, if Elliot's vampire had guard, which, which, like, if if Elliot's vampire was on a norm, any other team, and you could choose to give him guard or tackle, you would give him tackle because he's fucking strength five and edge five, and he goes places and does things, doesn't he? <laughs> so. That's what I'd do anyway. It's fun we've got the new zones there. They're, they're sorting out the artwork for them, at least. Got the icons and the artwork done, I think. Take stand firm for less TV. I, I wouldn't pay. For, I would never get sidestep for forty. Like forty TV for a double just makes doubles brutal now. Mm. 
Langley and I just hit block and armor probably. I think my Linos would get block and armor. <laughs> Everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their fucking life. I'll spray paint your ass. I mean, they're better than Notch 4, aren't they, with dodge? Essentially. Eight out of nine times, they, may, they succeed their dodges. You would expect them to succeed most of them. Britney alone. <laughs> oh man, maybe they should like call the team, like make a team called Leave Britney Alone and call everyone Britney and then every time they cast someone or KO someone, every time they remove somebody just type Leave Britney Alone in all caps. <laughs> Britney bitch. <laughs> yeah, that'd be pretty good, wouldn't it? Right, so where's the blitz come? Nowhere. Desperately need this uh, one to work. Good. And this one. Good. And this one. Nice. Comedy Mega.
Oh yeah, I could just call the team Toxic, and then <laughs> could call the team Toxic. Everyone on call Britney, and then uh, <laughs> and then leave Britney alone. <laughs> and uh, it's Britney, bitch. Yeah, that'd be pretty good. I can't spell his name. I even bought. I I did buy an album once. I literally did buy an angle but I didn't. Probably is the beast is there. At least he committed the beast over the other side. Yeah, Toxic is a great song. And it's been done, uh, it's been done by uh, that woman who did Touch Me All Night Long. Can't remember. Yeah. In like 1990. She mostly sung it, not Britney. Funny, isn't it? No, not some Fox. Like someone good. She writes lots of songs nowadays. This particular 90s lady. Kathy Dennis, yeah, there you go. Big Brain HTK. Not that one, no, no. Yeah, she like she's written some absolute bangers as Kathy Dennis. Like she she wrote that one herself. I'm pretty sure. Um, which is indeed a banger itself. Can't get you out of my head. Yeah. That is that was a hell of a song, wasn't it? Toxic. And Katy Perry's hit, I Kissed a Girl. There you go. Did a few S Club 7 ones. Quite a few. Quite a few S Club 7 ones. Sugar Babes. Sophie Ellis Baxter. Kelly Clarkson. So there you go. Crazy, yeah. A gaping hole. Is there a gaping hole? We could fail that.
Christ. Surf there would have been lovely. I can one D I can two D him and then one D him and then and then I'm I don't need to be guarded around the back, do I? But this is a three plus four. Alternatively I could dodge this. Or I could block him. And then I've got to move to block that one first. Let's do this one first. Really nice. Um. So yeah, if I block him, if I don't block him, he's got to go three, four, three. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, three. Three, four, three, and then a 2D. Thing is, if I go on the sideline, then they could blitz one and then pin me to the sideline, which isn't good. So blocking him seems quite a reasonable thing to do. But it is only a 1D, but it's just a 3 plus, isn't it? Yeah. And then this can like go here. Oh no, it can hit that one and come through. No, not really. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Perivel, yeah. Yeah. I mean I'm pretty happy with this to be fair, starting the half with eight players. Held on, hopefully. Maybe now what would have been good would would have been to have tried to give it to somebody else. Like, you know, maybe he's dodged this one out into the corner and then hand off to him so that it would be set off for the next time. So. I just go straight. No, it couldn't go straight in the corner. Because this one's got to be able to dodge in the corner. Might be able to dodge upfield if he uh, might give us a, an upfield play. Punt. Put the guard in, surf him, and then three plus two plus out. I could dodge there, obviously, and then go on the corner. That's probably the best bet. But the thing with that is, if I fail the first dodge, it's looking really bad, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, but he stopped that. No, he hasn't. Yeah, yeah, I can just cut, dodge this one out. Dodge this to here and then stay in the corner. Or dodge 1D. This guy can go somewhere and do something, but it's not really help because they're both tagged. So I'd have to. Double serve. I mean, the double serve needs just like so many dodges. Oh, 
bords du terrain, à portée des mains des fans qui ont l'air affamés. I just didn't want to risk like one in nining and just leaving the ball totally fucked. I think this was the safest. Well, I couldn't re-roll it. It's a it's a one D. If I re-roll it, then I skull. <laughs> like a hundred percent guaranteed. <laughs> a thousand percent. That's a skull, isn't it? If I, uh... <laughs> cast himself. <laughs> Failed this regen. <laughs> oh, God. That's Blood Bowl, isn't it? Fuck you for trying to win a game. Fuck you for trying to win a game of Blood Bowl. Oh, man. Brutal. Absolutely brutal. Ah, uh, she's dead and took the MVP with her. Well. Yeah, obviously got massively outblocked because took three cas in the first three turns. <laughs> the dodges were really good. Uh, not that, I mean, they were really good actually. 66, they should be, shouldn't they? 76, yeah, the dodges were actually really good. Foul appearances were shit. But then, they, you know, they weren't really shit because they're either 6 1 or 6 2. Like, they're either 7 1 or 6 2, aren't they? So, they were fine. Block dice were good, but uh, just all the cars instant. The instant cars were uh, made it a bit shit. Oh yeah, that's the that's the Britney one. <laughs> So only 11 men for the next match. I mean, I guess I could just... now. Nah, I could just replace it now, couldn't I? got the win glorious thanks for watching don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic